Hello all you jealous Michigan farmers, specifically tomato farmers. So today is August 15th and I am happy to report that we're getting tomatoes. Uh, most specifically, we're getting lots of sweet cherry 101s. They are delicious. Yummy while I eat them. I was a little worried because I didn't see any of the red cherry large at all, but apparently we are getting them. So that little guy is a red cherry large, and just for, for perspective, we'll put him next to the sweet cherry 101. So what they were saying was absolutely true, that um, that is a red cherry large, so that's the difference. Anyway, uh, the other thing I wanted to, to do, and we'll go ahead and do this together, is I wanted to take a look at the difference between the um, early girl and the golden girl. So. Our early girl we talked about earlier was kind of a mealy tomato and it looks like uh, they are getting some nice um, centers now although there is still some mealiness to it uh, but that's still a pretty good looking tomato I'd say so that's your early girl and then let's open up the golden girl here's our golden girl this is the first one I've ever had and they are the same. They're a little bit on the mealy side. Hopefully their flavor is a little bit nicer. This one's a little bit overripe. The skin is really soft. So I let it ripen a little bit too much. Um, there it is. So early girl and golden girl have a little bit more meat in the center than, than I particularly like. But let's go ahead and see what it tastes like. It actually has a nice um, creamy taste to it, unlike the foaminess you get with some of the more meaty type tomatoes. So these here are early girls. These right here, the um, stem actually fell off, so I um, I got, went ahead and left them on the stem, but I'm going to let them ripen on their own um, and see how they taste. So he's doing real well. He's coming along, and that one not so much. If he doesn't turn. I'll go ahead and turn him into a um, fried green tomato. And then I had to show you this one. I guess we'll call this a sweet cheek tomato. He had a little bit of a problem there coming together. Um, and then you'll notice also over here, we've got some romas. Um, some of those fell off the vine, so Joe went ahead and picked them for me. Let's go ahead and open one of these up, see what they're looking like on the inside. Yep. Uh, a little bit less on the... Um, the juice is on the inside, but still looks like a pretty good tomato. And let's give it a little taste. Tastes like aroma. Beginnings of some salsa. Okay, folks, so that's our update for today. We'll see you on the next one. Bye now.